All right, for this next segment, we are going to play Jeopardy for the PlayStation. Thank you very much, Alex. Let's see if you like these first round category. U.S. Cities, 1899. Literary Characters, The Supreme Court, Guinness Records, Four-Letter Words. Player One, you get us going. Four words, a hundred. A synonym for a small island. Ireland is an emerald one. What is Isle? Words for 200. It's a slang term for a potato. Anyone? A spud. Oh, yes. All right, pick again. Literary character is 100. In his will, Dr. Henry Jekyll names this person his beneficiary. Player one? Who is Mr. Hyde? Correct. You've got a commanding. Literary characters 200. All right, pick again. This Sinclair Lewis real estate broker is a man of zip and zowie. Anybody? George F. Babbitt. Literary characters 300. All right, pick again. Chance, an idiotic gardener, is propelled to fame in this Jersey Kaczynski novel. Being there. The right uh, let's do four other words for 300. Right, pick again. Daily Double. Player one, please make your wager. This device is used to soften the tone of an instrument, such as a trumpet. Player one. Uh, shoot. Uh, what is a horn? I don't know. Well, horn is four letters, but that's not the word that we needed. A mute. Four words for 400. This heaviest fencing sword has a bowl-shaped guard and a long, narrow blade with no cutting edge. Anybody? An epi. Or EP, however you say that. All right, pick again. A summoning gesture. It precedes and call. Anybody? It is bat and call. What is bat? All right, pick again. All right, literary characters for four. Adele Quested's trip to the Maribar Caves proves disastrous in this E.M. Forster novel. Player two. A passage to India. Correct. That's the one. Player two, what'll it be? Larry characters for 500. John Worthing's important fictional brother in a fictional play by Oscar Wilde. Player two. Who is Frank? I'm sorry, that's incorrect. No. Anyone? Ernest. 
All right, contestant two. Give this record's a hundred. This Oak Brook, Illinois corporation operates the world's largest food service chain. Player two. What is McDonald's? That's correct. That's the one. All right, pick again. Anna Karenay is the most famous luminous of these, over five million times as luminous as our sun. Player one. What is a star? That's it exactly. Okay. Player one. Guinness records for three hundred. The largest of these in the human body is usually the gluteus maximus. A muscle, of course. It's your turn, player one. This Asian city-state is the world's largest container port. Player three. Was it Singapore? You are correct. Yeah, that's the one. Player three, you choose. Guinness records for 500. A Fender Stratocaster belonging to this man who died in 1970 sold for a record $338,580 in 1990. Anyone? Jimi Hendrix. Contestant three, it's your turn. Yes, City's 100. The cities of Highland Park and Hamtramck are surrounded by this Michigan city. What is Detroit? One. Right you are. U.S. City's 200. Okay, contestant one. This Midwest city is home based to Cardinals, Rams, and Clydesdale. Clear one. What is St. Louis? To be sure. All right, pick again. Three hundred U.S. cities. Nevada's largest city. It grew from a population of 8,500 in 1940 to 258,000 in 1990. Anyone? Here's Viva Las Vegas. All right, pick again. 400. Hamar, Norway is a sister city of this largest North Dakota city. Fargo. All right, pick again. Edward Kennis designed the bronze lions guarding the main entrance to the art institute of this Midwest city. What is Chicago? To be sure. Yes. All right, pick again. Supreme Court 100. This Chief Justice chaired the commission that investigated the assassination of JFK. Anyone? Earl Warren. All right, pick again. Before Bush appointed him to the court, he was Assistant Secretary of Education for Civil Rights. Anyone? Clarence Thomas. All right, pick again. Among Associate Justices, office assignments, seating on the bench, etc., are determined by this. 
I'd say seniority, but I'm not sure. It was seniority. Okay. Should have rang in. 1899-100. This gangster, nicknamed Scarface Owl, was born January 17, 1899. Player one? Who's Al Pacino? Okay, uh, who is Al Capone then? You are correct. There we go. All right, take again. 1899-200. This country became a British protectorate in 1899, 91 years before its occupation by Iraq. What is Kuwait? 1899 for 300. All right, think again. Acetylsalicylic acid, better known as this, was introduced into widespread medical use. Layer two? Aspirin? Exactly. Yes. Layer two, what will it be? Well, actually, we did have hot water for our shower. That either scalding hot water or cold water. In 1899, August Strindberg moved from Lewin to this capital city. Anybody? It was Stockholm. And finally, going through three levels of management. Layer two? At the hotel, they finally agreed to compensate that there was something wrong. And they compensate us. This American territory, uh, whose capital is Pango Pango, was created by an 1899 treaty. Anyways, but then we found out that everybody was having the same problem. American Samoa. Okay, player two. The son of an Italian oh, immigrant, in 1986, he became the first Catholic appointed since Brennan in 1956. Yeah, no, no, like I said, we had a good time, we had a good time. It, it, is, it is a nice hotel. Antonin, Antonin Scalia. Right, last clue. The court struck down this type of tax uh, in you know, Poland thing, but, versus yeah. Farmers Loan and Trust Company in 1895. Oh, that was Player three. Income tax? That's it, exactly. Yes. That's it for the Jeopardy round. Player three takes the lead at the end of this round with 900. I have 800, and player two has 300. Player two is going to select first in double Jeopardy.